Hello everyone, Jack here from Sell Your Car to Jack and welcome to the final 2022 market movements. Throughout this year I've been giving you some tips and some ideas of what is happening in the used car market so you can make a good judgement call whether it's a good time to sell or keep hold of your car or even look at exploring prices on new cars. Now it's December and at the moment we have seen the most movement in used car prices that we have all year. They are falling. Prices are definitely falling in line with what is going on in the world, the economic climate, uh, fuel prices have increased, energy prices have increased, inflation rates have gone up. That directly affects the used car market and the supply and the demand. Supply of new cars into the market is increasing. It's still not up to the pre-COVID levels, but it is increasing. But what we've noticed is the demand for used cars has dropped off significantly. So during 2022, 33% less used cars have been sold compared to pre-COVID 2019. So the last couple of years, 2020, 2021, saw bumper years of used cars. Used cars went up in value because of that reason. And now throughout the duration of 2022, we have seen 33% less sales than pre-COVID. One of the biggest cars that we are noticing that are falling right now is actually the electric vehicle range. These prices are significantly dropping month on month. That's primarily due to the energy prices increasing. Some cases it's four to six times the amount to charge an electric car than it used to be pre-COVID. Therefore, people are actually realising that I've got to spend nearly £11,000 more for a comparable petrol vehicle and then charging the vehicle is actually a similar price to fueling a petrol car. Now, however, at the moment, the used car market has about a 15% market share of electric vehicle and diesel is only 10% of new cars coming in. So that means that the electric vehicles have been quite successful, but now with the energy prices that are quadruple or five times as much as they used to be, people are not spending as much on the electric cars they're actually opting for petrol cars. The one litre eco boost, the fuel efficient city cars are the better choice for most customers right now. What we're also noticing is the higher value cars. So anything north of 25 to 30,000 pounds, that is having a big decrease. The reasons for that is the inflation rate has gone up. So finance levels on a typical 25 or 30 grand car, it might be 700, 800 pound a month pre-COVID times or during the boom when the inflation rates were sort of a 0.5% of base. Now they're sort of reaching three to 4%, that's 700 pounds a month is now 1200 pounds a month. Therefore people are going, well, I'm not gonna allow to afford that. So the higher end, if you like, is actually dropping in price daily. So if you've got a car that is up at that scale, you might be worth getting out of that car sooner than later and opting for a cheaper vehicle that is going to be a little bit friendlier on the wallet over into 2023. The good cars at the moment are under £15,000, even under £10,000. People are optionally choosing to buy one of these cars, not have finance, cheaper running costs, cheaper tax, cheaper to fuel them. Um, so we're seeing that actually the level of valuation from sort of two grand up to 15 grand are holding their price, if not increasing. So if you do have one of these cars that fit into that bracket, it might be worth having a look at to see what that car is worth now, uh, because it might well be worth more than what it was valued at a handful of months ago. Now that seems quite a, a sort of doom and gloom update for you really. There's no significant evidence that the market is gonna drop suddenly and crash. Used cars are still out there on the roads, people are still buying them, people are still selling them, people still want to buy a used car from get to A to B. And people are used to now not using public transport as much as they was pre-COVID time. So it's not gonna drop, but it is falling. Um, used cars month on month always have done drop in valuations. So they go down in price as the mileage goes up and the age gets older, cars go down. So they're now back to before the boom. So before the COVID boom of car prices going up, they are back behind that value now. So they were just returning to where they should be, if I'm honest. Um, also, just to let you know, we've got the cash for Christmas deal on at the moment. So if you come and sell your car between now and the 23rd of December, uh, we'll get you, give you an extra £100 from the appraised price of once we've seen the vehicle. 
Uh, Merry Christmas to you all. I hope you have a great one and keep well and safe. And I hope that we can buy your car from you in the next year. If not, we're gonna give you some updates throughout the year, just give you some advice and some tips. If you want a fresh price on your car, just go to sellyourcartojack.com, put your registration and your mileage in, and we'll give you a free price there and then. Thanks very much, bye-bye.